Hi, I'm Brian Van, SportBikeTrackHere.com, and today we're going to do our 2018 Chest Protection Overview. You know, before I dive in too deep, I just want to take a minute and address the fact we don't have 20 different brands of product on the table. We don't have 500 chest protectors to compare. Every one of the items you see here, I personally handpicked. I've been riding bikes for a long time. I've been doing what I'm doing here for a long time. I'm a rider just like you, and I want to take all that experience and help get you the right product at the right price when you use it the experience is what you hoped it would. I believe in every one of these to the point where I have used or would use them. And I would also put my son Max in or any family member. These are all good quality pieces. I believe in it and we stock here at STG. We're gonna come right out with the big gun, right? If we're gonna talk chest or back protection, you cannot avoid the Alpine Stars Tech Air System. The airbag is everywhere you see vest. So for chest protection, this one wins. Integrated back protection, airbag, but it's also the most expensive and it doesn't fit into every piece of gear out there. But if you're riding in some of the new A-Star stuff, race suits that are tech air compatible or jackets, if you can swing the 1150, this is the way to go. Okay, we're going to go from most expensive to least expensive and then we're going to talk more and compare them. This is the Force Field Elite Chest Protector, $99.95. It is, of course, CE certified. It weighs 1.5 pounds. It is the largest of the chest protectors that we have here. Next up is the Tai Chi Flex Chest Protector, $59.95. It is not CE certified. Tai Chi has tested it internally, but it has not been subjected to or they didn't pay to have the CE certification. Alpine Stars CR chest protector. This is meant to be used in conjunction with their back protectors. We'll talk more about that in a minute. It is CE certified and with the harness it weighs 0.75 pounds. Alpine Stars KRCIR chest protector. $49.95 weighs 0.45 pounds. The last piece that I have here in front of me are the Alpine Stars KRCI chest inserts. These can be used for their race suits, their track vest too, or their jackets. CE certified, 0.45 pounds in weight, $39.95. Now we're going to talk about this from the perspective of application, real world application, racing track days. You want a chest protector to complement the back protector that you already own or perhaps you're going to buy one at the same time. These three pieces here can be used with any back protector out there. So I think comparing them head to head is absolutely fair. We'll open up again with the Force Field Elite. This is the biggest of the three. We'll display that. Largest footprint. It is also the thickest of the three. This is something you need to consider. Do you have room inside the suit to allow for the chest protector? This is the only one that comes with a strapping system. If your suit's not tight enough to hold this in place, you can use a strapping system to get that fit dialed in and keep it where it needs to be. How most people would wear it with a proper fitting suit is they're going to remove the strapping system from the chest protector and rely on the fit of the suit to hold it in place. There we go. I've got the strap system now off of the Elite and you can see the footprint. I mean, that is big for sure. Compare that with the A-Stars. And then the Tai Chi Flex. Cooling, that is another really important feature. This one has cutouts. These slots that you see in it are going to allow air to flow through. If your suit's perforated on the front side of your jacket, it'll flow in through these slots 
and you can see there are channels here. So the airflow is maintained behind that, but still, of the three that we're showing you right here, this one is going to block the most airflow. So the pros for this one are largest surface area. You could argue it's the most protective. The cons are weight, it's 1.5 pounds, a little heavier, and it is definitely thicker, so you have to have enough room in your suit to allow for it. Alpine Stars KR CIR. This one does not come with a strapping system, so this is meant to be held underneath your race suit. Your suit has to fit properly, you zip up, and just the tension is going to hold it in place. That is the most common way to use any one of the chest protectors. You'll see it uses a fully perforated design, so any of the perf in your suit, you're going to maintain that airflow, which is a feature a lot of people do gravitate towards. The base material is temperature sensitive and reactive. As it warms, it gets more moldable, comfortable, and flexible. The center plate is harder, so if you take a focused impact there, it'll try to collapse the cells and the material around it to manage the energy. Okay? By doing this composite design, you get a more comfortable protector. Where this thing wins, it's really lightweight, 0.45 pounds. It's thinner as compared to the force field and then you maintain all that airflow. The Tai Chi Flex Chest Protector. This is a unique piece because it's the only one that's not CE certified. Once again, do your own research. Tai Chi has tested this on their own. They just never sent it out and submitted, right? They're a Japanese company. They never sent it to Europe to have it CE tested, okay? It uses a removable outer cover, silicone grip panels, front and back sides. It's gonna help hold it into place. You can see the footprint here. It's available in two sizes. The size references the overall thickness of the protector. This is the four millimeter thick protector, and there's an eight millimeter thick. That is a part of the protector that they're talking about, not the whole protector. There is a polypropylene honeycomb core. The four mil uses four millimeters of that material. The eight mil uses eight millimeters of that material. The cover is removable. By doing so, we can give you a good look at the design they've used for the protector. Comparing it to the others, I would say there's, you know, there's a little more technology blended into this one. It's not just one material, it's multiple materials brought together in a really cool package. You've got a hard plate here. Behind that, is that polypropylene honeycomb core. Flexible so it moves with you. The base foam is perforated. 3D spacer fabric on the back. For the sternum, we have a flexible piece here. Very unique piece, 0.45 pounds, super lightweight, disappears in the suit because of the flex panels. If there's a takeaway with it, if that CE certification is really important to you, this one does not come with that. Now I'm going to get real Alpine Stars specific with the chest protectors. You have to have one of their current back protectors in order to use the Alpine Stars KRC chest protector. What they've done here is they've built a harness that has straps that replace the straps on your back protector and hook the chest right to the back protector. There is then a main zip in the front, so for entry and exit, you zip down, slide your arms through, pull it back together, zip up. So it's a really convenient package. If you've already purchased or you'd like to purchase that Alpine Stars back protector, you can have that integrated back and chest protection. Weight, 0.75 pounds, so it's not real heavy. Cost, $59.95. That's fair price for that for sure. They are, of course, CE certified. The base material that they use is going to be the Alpine Stars KRCI chest protectors. Temperature and heat sensitive reactive material. As they warm, they get more moldable, comfortable, flexible, fully perforated. So you're not going to lose airflow benefit if you have a perforated suit or perforated jacket that you will be wearing this under. Very convenient, very affordable, pairs very nicely with the A-STARS back protectors. Now let's talk about the cons. 
you'll see right here in the center, okay, there is no protective material. It's all on the sides. So if you take a shot dead bang in the center, you're not going to have coverage there. That would be a negative. The other takeaway could be you have to have an Alpine Stars back protector to use this. You can't just slide this under a race suit and hold it in place. Now we're going to talk about the Alpine Stars chest inserts, right? We sell a ton of Alpine Stars gear. That's our number one brand here for sure. In all their jackets and of course their race suits, there is foam padding installed in the chest compartment. You can pull that and install the CE certified chest inserts. We talked about them a little bit in that previous A-Stars piece. We'll do it one more time. The material, low profile, moldable, flexible, comfortable. It's perforated. You don't lose your airflow. All good things. CE certified, super lightweight at 0.45 pounds and very affordable at $39.95. This will go on all their race suits and their jackets. Any of the current offerings or the stuff from the last five years or so. Also, their track vest Two. This is a vest that incorporates their KR1 CE Level 2 back protector in a vest that comes with foam padding built in. The foam in here is just like the jacket or the race, so it can be replaced with the CE certified inserts. You simply pull that out and slide this in the chest. And you're going to have chest and back protection in a real efficient and convenient vest. Okay, I've got the chest inserts installed in the track vest too. Now we have CE certification in the chest armor as well as a CE certified back protector in this really cool, easy to wear vest. You can see there's also foam padding and several other areas to take and amp up the protection in those hot spots as well. So you have a really cool protective piece. Okay, there you have it. There's 2018 chest protector comparison. We're all different riders and that's why I have different products here. I don't have 20 different products because at the end of the day, the ones that I have on the table, they are the best in my opinion to get the job done. So what do I like best? Well, I mean, that's, that's easy, okay. If you have the budget for it, this is the best, hands down. If you can afford it, this is what you should be riding in. Not everybody's in that position, for sure. So, where would I go from there? Well, if I'm in a race suit, I'm racing on the track, boy, I gotta tell you, ah, this is really a special little piece. I like it, I like the way it moves. You know, I like the materials that they've used with it, maintain the perforation. This one is nice because of the flexibility to it. Temperature sensitive, warms, okay? Both good pieces. I kind of like that one just a little bit more. If you have the room and all you care about is the most protection, you can't swing this, this is a great choice, no doubt. We sell so much Alpine Star stuff here. It's a great brand. It's my, I love it. It's one of my favorite brands for sure. It has been for many years now. If you have one of their jackets or suits, these inserts are awesome. They just slide right in, $39. I mean, it, it, they take up no more room than the foam that comes in there, and they protect you more. It's crazy to not ride with these in there if you have the pockets. I'll say that for sure. And then if you want to buy one of their new back protectors and have that whole kind of rig deal, that's pretty bitching too. So I know you probably want me to say, well, this is for sure the best. This is the right. But we're all different riders. We all have different expectations of the product, and I hope this helps you pick the right one for yourself.